We're here at Marcus Garvey Drive, the warehouse or one of the warehouses of the National Health Fund. And the purpose today is to look at our vaccine preparation. At the NHF, we have the cold storage facility and there is a space there for an immediate 600,000 doses of vaccine, but enough that could hold the 2 million if we make adjustments. We have the igloos or the mobile cold storage facilities with the, the ice packs to move from one location to the next. And the team is fully prepared and ready to receive and to deploy uh, with proper training that has been done. Here at Shalimar, we have the syringes or what will be used to administer the vaccine in the arms. We have the registration forms for persons that are going to be um, receiving the vaccines. And we have smaller igloos and large igloos also, but smaller ones that can store the vaccine in the remote areas, in the health centers, in the clinics, so that the team through the regions can then administer. Remember now, our policy is to get a safe vaccine signed off by the World Health Organization. I think we're very close to that, very, very close, but I'm prepared not to state a date until it is on its way in the aircraft or on the ship, but it will get here. When it gets here, I want to reassure all Jamaica that we have the capacity to preserve its integrity, to ensure that there is adequate security and to make sure that it is safe for uh, use and for those who are receiving it. The team has worked hard. I'm very uh, comfortable with the work that they are doing. Uh, I want to commend them for the efforts. This again is another critical response to the COVID challenge that we face. Thank you.